Hi children, today let's do another topic. I'm sure you're going to enjoy ordinal numbers. Wherever we go, there is a queue system formed. Okay, and then you will say, oh, I'm first, he's last. Or you will say, I'm second. So we are going to look at ordinal numbers. Who comes first? How to write the spelling? How to write the short form for the ordinal numbers? Shall we look at them? I am sure you are going to enjoy this exercise. Let's look at our first. Let's recall to our mind the ordinal number that we have already learned. Now look at the queue here. Alright? Just look at the queue here. You are getting into the door. And that's the first person. How do you spell first? F I R S T. First. I am first. Yes, I have to go into the door, into the room first. Very good. Look at the second one here. First person, second. Spell second. S E C O N D. Second. So this is the second person. Good. Let's look at the third. Spell third. T H I R D. Third. Good. Let's go on. Look at the fourth person. Good. Spell fourth. F O U R T H. Fourth. And finally, we have a last person here. Fifth person. Spell fifth. F I F T H. Fifth. So, we have first, second, third, fourth and fifth. All the persons, big and small, all are standing in ordinal numbers. No problem here. Good. Did you enjoy? Let's look at another picture. Look for yourself. Good. Look at this. School bus. When you enter and when you come out, you cannot rush. You must come out one at a time so that you don't fall. Good. See who is first here. The little boy has come out first from the bus and he's very happy. Spell first. F I R S T. First. Good. The little girl says, I am second. I came out second from the school bus. Spell second. S E C O and the second and the little boy says I'm third spell third T H I R D third so these are ordinal numbers first second third and goes on good shall we look at another picture look what you have here look at this you queue up in the cloud the teacher will say come on Stand in a queue. And there the teacher stands. And the first little girl, she says, Look, I am first. Spelled first. F-I-R-S-T. First. And here the second little girl, spelled second. S-E-C-O-N-D. Second. And here the third little girl, spelled third. T-H-I-R-D. Third. And then here the little boy says, I am fourth. F O U R T H. Fourth. And then another little girl here, he says, I am the fifth. F I F T H. Fifth. And finally, you have a last girl, sixth. S I X T H. Sixth. Look at the spellings. You must learn to say and write the spelling correctly. First, second, third. Fourth, fifth, sixth, all the children are standing in ordinal number system. Look here. Okay? There's order here. Good. Let's go on. Look at this. Now let's learn ordinal numbers. Look. What is the first one here? Look at the spelling. F I R S T first. First. How do you write first? You write number one and the short form S T. 
you read this as first. Spell first, F-I-R-S-T first and you represent first like this. You put one and S-T next to it first. Look at, this is second. Spell second, S-E-C-O-N-D, second. How do you represent second? Look, you write two and write N D next to it, second. So you read this as first, second. Good. Let's look at the third. Spell third, T H I R D, third. How do you represent third? Put number three and write R D next to it, third. Good. Now look, look at the fourth spelling, F O U R T H, fourth. How do you represent fourth? Put four and put th at the side. Fourth. Good. Look. Spell fifth. F-I-F-T-H. Fifth. And how do you represent fifth? Put number five and put th fifth. Good. Five and th fifth. Good. Are you enjoying? Good. Look at this. Six. S I X T H. Sixth. How do you represent six? Put number six and put T H at the side. How do you read this? Sixth. Spell seventh. S E V E N T H. Seventh. And we represent seventh by putting number seven and T H at the side. And you read this as seventh. Good. Look, eight. Spell eight. E I G H T H. Eight. How do you represent eight? Put number eight and put T H at the side. How do you read this? Eighth. Good. Look, nine. Spell nine. N I N T H. N I N. TH 9th and represent 9th by putting 9 and TH. Good. We read this as 9th. And finally, we have 10th. T E N T H 10th. How do you write that? Put number 10 and TH at the side. Now, all this first, first, second, second, third, third, fourth, fourth. Fifth, fifth, sixth, sixth, seventh, seventh, eighth, eighth, ninth, ninth, tenth, tenth. So these are the spellings of ordinal numbers 1 to 10. And you represent, when you don't want to write the full spelling, then we represent the spelling by writing the numbers and the short form. One. And then you put ST first, 2 and ND second, 3 and RD third, 4 and TH fourth, 5 and TH fifth, 6 and TH sixth, 7 and TH seventh, 8 and TH eighth, 9 and TH ninth, 10 and TH ten. So you know how to represent the ordinal numbers. Yes? Good. Did you enjoy? Shall we go on children? Look. See what you have. We have already done 10. Now we have 11 to 20. It's a little difficult. Look carefully and we'll learn the spelling. Okay? Now. The ordinal numbers and the spellings are here. And then how do you represent each of these? We will do just like we did from 1 to 10. Now this is 11. So we read the 11 as 11th. Where is the 11th child? The teacher will ask. When you stand in a line, the teacher will say, 11th little girl, please come here. Spell 11th. E-L-E-V-E-N-T-H. Repeat after me. E L E V E N T H 11th. How do you represent 11th? Write number 11 
and write th at the side. And we read this as 11th. This is how we represent 11th. Ordinal number 11. Good. Let's take the next. 12th. T W E L F T H. Look at it again. T W E L F T H. 12th. How do you represent 12th? You put 12, number 12, and write T H at the side, and we read this as 12th. Good. Let's look at the next one. This is 13th. Spell T H I R T E E N T H. 13th. And we represent 13th as put number 13 and TH at the side. Read this 13th. Good. Now, this is 14th. Look at the spelling F O U R T E E N T H. 14. How do you represent 14? Write number 14 and TH at the side. Read this 14th. Good. Now we have here 15th. Spell F I F T E E N T H. 15. How do you represent 15th? You write 15 number and write TH at the side. Read this 15th. Good. Now, look at this. 16. Spell for me. S I X T E E N T H. 16. How do you represent 16? Put number 16 and write T H at the side. Read this. 16. Good. Next. 17. Spell. S-E-V-E-N-T-E-E-N-T-H. S-E-V-E-N-T-E-E-N-T-H. 17. How do you represent 17? Put number 17 and write T-H at the side. Read this. 17. Good. Now we look at 18. Ordinal number. 18. Spell 18. E I G H T E E N T H. 18. How do you represent 18? Put 18 and T H at the side. Read this. 18th. Good. And then this is 19. Spell 19th. N I N E T E E N T H. 19th. How do you represent 19? Number 19 and put TH at the side. Read this. 19. And finally, we have 20th. Spell 20th. T W E N T I E T H. 20th. How do you represent? Write 20. And then write TH at the side. Now, look, let's read all the representation here. 11th, 12th, 13th, 14th, 15th, 16th, 17th, 18th, 19th and 20th. So we have here ordinal numbers from 11 to 20th. Did you enjoy children? Good.